Yeah, so what happened is I got a flat and uh, and I want to move the bike around now because I'm already sweating and uh, there's a pretty big piece of metal in there and uh, yeah basically I'm riding for the last 10 plus miles on a flat tire and I thought well, maybe I'll take you guys on the journey for a little bit, not for long, boring why but I tried a fixed flat and um, oh Holy crap, what's that? I tried fix flat and uh, well that didn't work and tried to add up but again the, there was a pretty big piece of metal in there I saw I tried to take it out, but I was pretty deep in the tire, and of course, you know, you never have the tools with you that you need. I'm still kind of building up uh, what's important and what's not so important, and I think a needle nose plier set is important. Uh, let's go. And I was not. Uh, not the most amazing ride as you can tell kind of sucks actually but uh, what you gonna do you know no choice got my hazard light on hope people are patient with me and uh, yo Make a right turn on red. The thing is, like when you turn, you gotta be careful. This is really like feels weird. Straight, not so bad, but turns. You gotta keep the bike straight. Most important. Otherwise, it's comes real weird, you know, I mean, no wonder, right, I mean, him. so I hope there's nobody behind me right here, not really, so I gotta make a turn here left, so that's basically how I'm riding, uh, pretty much 20 miles an hour, not more, uh, I have a feeling if I go too fast, uh, uh, the rubber is gonna get too hot, and, uh, here we go again, and then it, you know, even softer, I mean, like, move the clutch a little bit, and then, here we go, and, uh, yeah, I'm basically now, uh, drove already 13 miles just like that, and, uh, 2.3 miles to go. I'm not gonna take you guys on this boring ride all the way back. I really hate to hold up traffic. I mean, I know it sucks when you're behind somebody, but what can you do, you know? Come on, man. Oh, traction control bitch again. But well, if I that's because of the different tire diameter. If I put it down to one after the next uh, stop, it's gonna be gone. Just because the tire is so flat right now. Mm. 
gonna stop here. Yeah, guys, go, go. But I mean, I thought I'm gonna film a little bit. It just shows you that, uh, you know, it's not the end of the world if you can't fix the tire. But I think I'm gonna get me some tubeless rims for this bike while I do the conversion of those wheels and make them tubeless because this is my second flat in literally two weeks I mean, there's just too much junk here in the city on the roads and uh, yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do I don't see myself uh, fixing tires once a month sounds like it sucks or limping home, you know, I mean, this time it was only 15 miles, but, you know, a few hundred miles away, then it's not fun anymore. Well, it's not fun anyway, but that becomes kind of like a pain. I was like a mile away from Walmart, I jumped in there, I got me like this fixed flat tire, and thought that it's usually only going to work with tubeless tires but I mean worth a shot 10-15 bucks and uh, yeah so much about that yeah yeah okay, better than walking no it could have been worse is what the governor said So I guess I better stop before we just wait for somebody to not to stop. Okay. I would say, guys, we call it a day. I'm almost home. A mile out. Should go smooth now. Thanks for watching as always.